Hey guys, I'm Marcia stepping in for video, Matt, and I'm here with We the Kings, Travis Clark. Hi. How's it going, Travis? It's awesome. It's going awesome. awesome. Going awesome. It's going, awesome. going great. You guys are on the Long Hair uh, Don't Care Tour? Yes. Is that named after you? Uh, after everybody, actually. After everybody. Uh, made a rule that if you wanted to join the tour, you weren't allowed to cut your hair, so. How'd that go? Did everybody follow it? Yeah, so far. There's been a... Uh, there's been one person who I will not name who cut their hair, uh, but they just, it, at the end of the tour, for tour pranks, they'll get it. They'll get it back? The they'll get it back? Yes. And so is this your first time headlining a tour? Yes, yeah, it is. Is it it's, awesome so far? It's really cool. I, we didn't know how to uh, how to do everything, because um, like we've always been like an opening band, and like if you say something stupid on stage, you'd be like, oh, we'll give it up for blah, 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 whoever's the headliner. Mm -hmm. And now that you're headlining, when you, we say stupid stuff on stage, we're just kind of like, Oh, that was really stupid. We it's a little bit that. more pressure then? Yeah, a lot more pressure. A lot more pressure. And, and I get nervous even more before shows, so it's rough. You still get nervous even after all your experience? Yeah. It's crazy. That's crazy. It's not healthy. Not healthy. So you have two music videos up on YouTube. The yes. newest one is Check Guest Juliet. Uh -huh. It's a pretty cool video. How much input did you guys have in it? We, uh, well, when we wrote the song, like, or when we were talking about doing the video, we pretty much just wanted to, like, them to keep the video as uh, relevant to the song as possible, so it's like the typical like Romeo and Juliet uh, music video, and I don't know, like pretty much when he gave us the treatment for it, we were just like, that is so cool and awesome, and all the in the only input that we had is like how we acted each scene, like mm -hmm. he, he like it was very like free, and, and uh, he gave us the uh, availability to like you know voice our opinion on like what scenes were cool and what like wasn't. So <clears throat> I don't know, it was awesome. I read somewhere that you guys are going to be playing on Warp Tour, and that you're going to be playing all the dates on Warp Tour. Yeah, it's our first Warp Tour ever. And yeah, stoked. Uh, we are, we are. We've, we've always gone as kids and uh, to see like our favorite bands, and now we are a band that's playing. And uh, we don't know what stage we're on yet, but uh, it's going to be so fun. I can't wait. So we'll be sure to check them out at Warp Tour, guys. And then, so I heard in another interview that you did back in March that you guys were getting the Wii pretty soon, or you wanted to get the Wii for Super Smash Brothers. Did you end up getting it? No, no. Uh, financially, we are incapable of getting the Wii. But uh, I always get nervous like when people are like, I saw in one interview where you said, like, that, that first statement, I was like, oh, crap, what did I say, what did I say? But, uh, <laughs> but no, we don't have the Wii yet. And because now, like, last with Video Matt, we were in a bus, mm -hmm. and we were doing the bus to bus connection with uh, with Cobra, Cobra Starship, and now we're, we're all in vans, um, just because, like, there was nobody else in a bus, and we didn't want to be, like, the only, like, loaners with a bus, so we're just like, let's go back into the van. And so, the van doesn't have a lot of space, so, like, if you're Wii Smash Brothers, it gets intense, <laughs> and I, you know, like, we hit each other, we can't even play Halo anymore, we're so bummed, because our TV screen is, like, this small, and with the four screens, it's just, it doesn't work. But, but at home or the next time we're in a bus, definitely we Super Smash Bros. That's where it's at. That's where it's at for all. Yes. And uh, so I guess then for entertainment, you guys are riding around on a scooter back here? Yes. I'll be right back. I'm going to shoot the scooter. We got to go get the scooter, guys. So now we're here with the infamous scooter. Did you guys just get caught on it or something? Yeah. We, we, uh, we just got a ticket for riding the scooter. I mean, he couldn't have given us a ticket for a bunch of stuff, but he gave us a ticket for not wearing a helmet. And uh, here it is. The citation. How much is it going to cost you? <laughs> I don't know. He gave us a number to call to figure out how much it was. <laughs> so we're not really sure. Please. But uh, but I don't awesome. know. It doesn't really stop us riding. We're going to ride and, and just make stuff up. But this thing is so awesome. We bought it before tour so that we could ride around places. Uh huh. And, uh, Do you follow the van in it on the road while you guys are going to the next place? No, but it does go 80. That's a fun fact. How much were you going when uh, you got caught? It was not a speeding ticket. Cool. We were stopped at a stop stoplight and, and the guy got on the intercom deal. He's like, just pull into the next parking lot, please. And we looked back at the state trooper and I had uh, Billy, no. our uh, front of house dude, no. on the back. And he was like, oh crap. So we pulled in. He's like, you don't have a license yeah. plate. You don't have a helmet. You don't have a registration. You're not from California. A bunch of stuff. I mean, he could have gotten us on a really heavy thing, but. He just gave us a, a warning and then a citation for not wearing a helmet. Yeah. Well, is there anything else you guys want to say to your fans or you want to say to anybody out there? Plug anything? Talk um, about your CD? Yeah. Oh, we oh, have a CD. 
It came out October 2nd. It's entitled We the Kings by We the Kings and written by We the Kings. And you'll see it under the We the Kings shelf at any We the Kings Target Market stores. Anyways, go buy the CD. If you like it, I love you. If not, you just throw the CD at me next time you see me. You're like, it's crap. I hate it. But uh, I love you guys all for coming to the shows and for watching this on YouTube and wherever else. It's going to be posted. You guys are great. Video Matt. Where the hell are you, dude? Peace. <laughs>